these are the three types of glassware you might find when uh, in a biology lab. All three of them hold volume, right? So why all the different shapes and sizes? Well, this one right here is the beaker. And beakers are really good for getting a volume of water um, and transferring it to another volume. And so uh, if I want an accurate measure of volume, this is just an indicator. It's not really accurate. So for an accurate measure of volume, then I would use what's called a graduated cylinder. This is a graduated cylinder. You can tell it's a graduated cylinder because it has degrees. So holding this flat, say I want 90 mils. The beaker allows me to very delicately transfer that liquid precisely. Rather than if I just held this under the sink, it would be it wouldn't be flat, and it'd also come out too fast, and you couldn't control it. So beaker graduated cylinder. This right here is called an Erlenmeyer flask, named after a guy named Flask. So you would transfer your liquid into here, into the Erlenmeyer flask. Erlenmeyer flasks are more for if you're going to do reactions or mix things because it has this small opening on top with the volume on the bottom. Plus this makes you look like a cool scientist. All right, three types of glassware.